Hey guys, Tegan here from BlueSense Digital, and in this video, I'm gonna go through how to see what search terms you're ranking for within Google Ads. Uh, this is essential, especially in the early stages of an ad account, to see whether you're ranking for relevant search terms or not. Diving straight into this, the first thing to mention is that the search terms report is only available for certain campaign types. One of the most popular campaigns that is currently run on Google Ads at the moment is called a Performance Max campaign. And unfortunately, these search terms reports don't exist for Performance Max. In the scenario that I've just mentioned, let's say for when you are running a new Google Ads account, we wouldn't recommend starting with Performance Max anyway. Specifically for search campaigns and shopping campaigns, standard shopping campaigns, this search terms report is available. So how to access that? Let's go to a standard shopping campaign. And from there, go to keywords that drop down or default to negative keywords and then click on search terms over here. As you can see here, these are the search terms that we're ranking for and you can change the columns that are in the search terms report to reflect the data that you want to be seeing. For example, let's just say we wanted to see which search term had spent the most in the specific time period. And as you can see, it was the search term blood pressure monitor that had spent just under $350 out of that specific search term. Again, you can adjust the columns and the metrics that you wanna be seeing using this columns breakdown over here. Then just as a little bonus tip, let's say for example, there were some keywords in here that we didn't want to be ranking for. You can just select that specific keyword and add that immediately as a negative keyword. That will ensure that you don't rank for that particular term again. And just for reference, that'll automatically be added into this negative keyword section over here. So another little quick video for you. Hopefully that was a help and hope you got some value out of that. If you have any further questions on anything I went through there, please leave them in the comments and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you enjoyed this, like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.